Hey folks, how y'all doing? This is KVSMC, our Virolocity. I'm doing an update on my video on my battery bank. Uh, 270 amp hours, 24 volt. And I got everything in series parallel. And fuse. And with a battery switch. It's on the arm position now. Y'all can see that. Okay, with a Blue C's battery switch. And these are my fans and exhaust. And here's the intake, which uh, they come on at like 27.2 volts from out back and charge controls. And here's my battery bank. Uh, thank y'all out there for pointing out what I did wrong. But now I have them in series parallel. Uh, this this I'm going from the negative, positive, negative to positive right there. All right, and negative to positive. I have six batteries, and I also got them connected in parallel. All right, and there's my negative jumping over to the other set of battery banks right here and jumping over to the other set of battery banks right here and right here is my positive jumping over to the other set of battery banks right here sorry I need some more light on this subject here uh, here we go right here on to here right there and there we go. And there's one, like I say, my pot, my negative and pot series parallel. And it's working great. Super great. And we're getting some wind today. It's a super hot, humid day. The heat index is terrible out here today. But that's how I got my battery bank. Uh, and I got my battery space apart. As you can see. even gap all the way down all the way through and here the battery key was I'm using these are uh, from a parallel hookup these are 24 inch 2 off these got a 24 volt battery bank and the other ones are 4 off going from 12 volt to 12 volt here we go uh, kind of hard to zoom in on them Anyway, it's two off. Two off battery bank cable. 24 inch. Give me plenty of room. And anyway, it's working great. Right now we're producing. Right now we are producing 110 watts, 1100 watts. Made 2.9 kilowatt hours a day, and it's cloudy. And I overcast at it today. And we're putting out, or selling, or everything's going back to the house and the main big shop and this little shop, 700 watts of power. It's going back to everything. And I have a, on my, my, my meter here, my meter, I mean, it's just working phenomenal. Oh, uh, it's working really good. Oh. Uh, on meter here also I got one of these blue line innovations meter power cost monitor and it tells me how much I produce each day and it's wireless so that's a bad man pajama and it tells you uh, tells you everything that's going on temperatures out here 88 degrees and I got the fans rolling today the cool down inverter which is uh, 101.7 and it's 91 degrees at that part I got fresh air and thanks Larry for hooking me up with these endless breeze 12 volt fans they are the bomb and it's blowing fresh air in here or I can burst around 
I took the legs off and I used the window to hold the fan in place. That looks pretty good. And uh, also, let me show you, show you something here. I'll show you how good this past month, for the month of July, I'll show you what all we did here. That kind of wrinkly here. <laughs> but there we go. Proof is in the pudding. $8.64. Last month, $12.13. Last year in July, I burnt 15 kilowatt hours. But since then, I added a total of 700 watts in my battery bank. This July, I've only burnt 2 kilowatt hours. So everything is working great. Battery bank, wind, the solar, this and that. And I'll work a whole lot better since I get to my battery hooked up correctly. Thank you all out there, YouTubers. But yep, proof's in the pudding. $8.64. And yeah, I'm happy. Break even. And it shows my kilowatt, total kilowatt hour usage is 2. I'm number two. Woohoo! And last August, I brought one kilowatt hour. Last September, I brought one kilowatt hour. So we're hoping to get as good as that. I hope, or, hope we get that good. So yeah, I'm pretty happy. Solar and wind is the way to go. I like solar over everything. And I love my power company. And they love me. And uh, I, I, I called back a while back, talked to one of the supervisors, and they asked me, Hey, is anybody living at your house? Your, your bill is awful low. I said, Yeah, I, I live here 24 <laughs> 7. I thought that was funny. I told him I had a solar uh, genset uh, for backup emergency power and helps me save energy, too. And they're, they're good. They're good with that. So, yeah, it's all good. All good. I had the county inspectors come by and uh, look at my backup system and all that good stuff and I was building my big building and everything's good to go. Oh, and I'm a happy guy. Y'all can see that. Eight dollars six four cent. Alright, how you doing? Alright. <laughs> but anyway, and I data log everything every day and my system data logs everything. Right now we're putting out a hundred right at fourteen hundred watts. And that's like a saver the saver pass. And that just went out. Uh, and it's hot out here, let me tell you. But yeah, that's what we're producing. Oh yeah, I'm loving it. But yeah, it's doing a good job. Battery bank. Temperature is a ooh, sorry about that, y'all. Is at 85 degrees. And that's my wind diversion control loader by Morning Star. Temperature out max 88.3 at 12.3. Humidity is 75 percent. It is smoking. Let me tell you smoking out there today. It's just humid. Alright, and our not to get all sucky here, but I replaced my light bulbs are LEDs. Those are 12 waters. Equivalent to 60 watts. Incandescent. And here's another LED. <laughs> and I replaced, I got 75% of the house and my other shop, and this shop with LED lights. Alright. And let's go with my system here. I'm going to show y'all, take y'all out here. The back 40. Uh, right here, I place the other thing with the LEDs in here also, except for fluorescence. I got the AC running in here and another building. But she's working good. 
extremely good, y'all. Got my combiner boxes. And there's that endless breeze sucking in the cold air. Cooler air, that is. <laughs> to help keep all my equipment nice and cool. But everything's working like a charm. Battery bank checks out. Got, got put my meter on all the batteries. Battery's doing great. But here are the conditions today. Kind of overcast, cloudy, a little bit of sun coming through there, a little bit and pieces of sun coming out. And there she is, the old sunshine, thank God. Alright, and here we go. I'm going to show you my system from my back up again. Many times. Big old stump over here. My neighbor's stump. But there she is, y'all. There's my system. So I got 2300 watts total of solar, 2310. And these little ones are my little small off grid system. That's 195 watts of total power. Sorry, I just had a bug on my leg. I gotta, I gotta clean that off. I'll be squirting them down tonight or tomorrow, early tomorrow morning. But everything is checking out great. And got a little bit of wind today. A little bit of wind from the south. About 5 to 10. Everything's, everything's checking out good, y'all. Everything's checking out real good. Well, hey, I wanted to thank y'all for watching. And y'all have a good one. Thank y'all. Ooh, take this old glass off. But yeah, she is she is toasty warm out here today. I'm sweating like a oh uh, I can't say it, but anyway, I'm sweating big time. Like a lady in church. Alright. <laughs> Just kidding. Alright, yeah, y'all have a good one now. Uh, thank y'all for watching. This is KBSMC. Please subscribe. Thank y'all for watching. Alright. Bye bye.